All right, so I'm going to start on this story of how I was homeless in Denver. I mean, in Colorado. I've been everywhere when I was homeless. Denver, fucking Lakewood, uh, Colorado Springs, down near Pueblo. I've been a lot of places fucking homeless. So December 15th of 2015, I decided I was going to be homeless. So I was living at a... A guy that I met named Andre, I moved in with him probably within like a couple of weeks of starting to work at this company called Tarumo. And uh, I was in a car, living in a car that my baby mom, mom had sold me for a hundred dollars because she had got a new car and she knew I needed a car. So she had sold it to me for a hundred dollars. So I asked him if I can like, you know, uh, I don't remember how I asked him. I was like, can I move in? Like, I was like... How the fuck would I even ask that question? I don't even remember, bro, but I was like, hey, like, can I, can I, like, uh, move in? I'll pay you rent. Something like that. And he was just like, he was weird about the situation because he didn't know who I was. He was like, you ain't like no thief or nothing. I was like, nah, I ain't no fucking thief. Like, I ain't say it like that. I was like, nah, I ain't nothing like that. Like, you can trust me. Like, real shit. Like, come on, bro. Like, and I'll pay you. So, uh, he lived in a studio apartment. Now, when I moved in, his girlfriend had got kicked out. Well, she didn't get kicked out. They got in, like, some type of fight. Something. She ended up getting arrested. He ain't pressed charges. At first, he was. He was going to press charges. It was a whole bunch of shit, but it was a studio apartment. And it was weird because, like, she ended up moving back in. So, I'm, like, just sleeping on the floor. Like, say, like, the door is literally right here to the left. Like, you just, it's right here uh, on my left, which would be... I don't know, it's just like, you walk in, it's just the bed right there, go down, it's bathroom, then the kitchen, that's it. So I would always just sleep on the floor when I come in. And it was weird when it's like, baby mom went there, moved back in, because it was her and his son, and me and him worked at the job, but he ended up getting fired, ended up getting a security job and shit, and... That's just a whole nother story. So when I got my car, I just decided I was going to move out. Uh, his mom ended up coming to visit, and I didn't want to be in the way. Like, we didn't even talk. This was, like, the weird shit. And I went and got me a car, and I just decided I was going to be in the car. So I just was in my fucking car. And that was uh, December 15th. Now, I think I might have already had my car for... Yeah, I had to have already had my car. I don't even know when the hell I got my car because I know I came out to visit California in November for Thanksgiving and December for Christmas. Damn, this story just gets so juicy. And it was just weird because it's like just me move like me, my baby mind up leaving me a month after my son was born. And she went to Iowa, back to her hometown. And uh, I'm, the reason why I went on my trip, damn, I got to backtrack with this fucking story. The reason why I went on my trip was because she went to her hometown and she ended up running into her ex. And he's trying to have sex with her. And I'm like, well, where's my son at? Like, my son right there asleep. So I'm like, at work, fucked up, I'm heartbroken. Like, I got to manage my whole fucking crew. And I'm just like, I don't know what to do. And everybody just seen it like, hey, like, you all right? Like, like, you ain't yourself type shit. And I'm trying not to break down. So I'm like, fuck it. Like, I'm finna be on some just fuck bitches type shit. So I was like, I need to travel. So came to California. My baby mama in California trying to be the first dibs because my dad didn't told her I'm coming out here. He got to pick me up from the airport. So she already on it. Like, well, let me know when you get out here type shit and just was on it. I'm... Just trying to hump on something. I was talking to one of my exes from childhood. Told her I was coming out here, so I'm already set up with her type shit. Baby mom interrupt all that. So, anyways, I'm just out here on some dog shit. Couple vacations. Go back to fucking um, Colorado. Then I go back in December, around like. Christmas, fucking child support seized my damn account, so I had to set up overdraft, because I didn't have no money, they took all my shit, set up overdraft just to overdraft, my ticket was already paid for, and uh, 
come back to California, go back to sleep in the back of my fucking truck. Then on top of that, like before this, I'm good with my job because I can work like second shift and my shift and like make my own ba- paycheck basically. But I was just sleeping in my truck the whole fucking time. And like it would be weird because like it wasn't bad. Like to be honest, it wasn't bad being homeless because um, I had a my job had a shower so I can always shower and change clothes. Um, then I just wouldn't be leaving. So they'd be watching me on the camera and then they call my supervisor and have them leave because the security used to circle through the damn lot. So then they basically kicked me out off the, the campus. So he was just like, you know, like I wouldn't mind, but security is driving around. They see you in the car, sleep for hours and stuff like that. So I end up going to this Arby's around the corner and sitting in the parking lot and I would just sleep there until I had to go back to work. I did that shit for I don't know how long. Then... My bae mom, my first bae mom, she ended up coming out there with my son. It was supposed to be just my son, but then she made it seem like she didn't have nowhere to go. So I ended up bringing them out there. Whole time I'm good, so I'm good. I'm good when I when I didn't book their tickets and shit. End up fucking getting fired, and their tickets are already booked. So now I'm trying to renege on the situation with my baby mom. Like, can it just be just my son? Because I got someone for him to go. You, I don't really know. It's all this shit. So they already booked on coming. I'm fucking sleeping in my damn truck. It's uh, snow time and all this shit. And I'm going to fast forward and tell the rest of this story on, uh, on that. Because I got to upload this video. It's too long.